Okay, we're back live here inside New York. This is Silicon Angle's coverage of Hadoop World, Strata plus Hadoop World. O'Reilly Media um, has now running the Strata and Hadoop Conference. It's uh, in New York City. It's part of Big Data Week in Silicon Angle and Wikibon.org are covering this like a blanket. We've been here for two days. We were prior previously out in uh, Las Vegas for IBM's Information on Demand, or IOD, conference, and uh, this is about big data, really coming into its own, uh, intersecting with business. This is now the second year where we've seen the business side and the geek side really kind of blend together. That's really the top story here in New York. Uh, my co-host Dave Vellante and I have been interviewing um, a lot of guests. We've had a packed schedule, and just want to take the time to summarize kind of the top news here, and the top news essentially is uh, every startup that's in big data is doing a lot of announcements. Hallways are packed. Over 3,000 people have signed up via O'Reilly, and it's been amazing. And I uh, want to shout out to our sponsors who make this happen, who help underwrite this independent editorial coverage of the queue, which we love to do and bring this to you, the signal from the noise at Silicon Angle. And our thanks goes out to Cloudera. Cloudera is the big data platform. They're the headline sponsor. I want to thank Cloudera. And also MapR. MapR also stepped up with some, with some support. And both those companies have been really supportive of theCUBE over the past two and a half years. And we're proud to bring all this great coverage. Other companies, Hortonworks, Hadapt, MapR, Datastax, um, and on and on and on. So we're here, hallways are packed. Um, and I'll see the top news outside here is Windows 8 is uh, rocking and rolling. And uh, you know, that that's really a, the big story out in the web right now is Windows 8. Um, and I, Windows has been getting slammed a little bit here. I'm not, I'm sure. They've been getting slammed a lot. New York Times ran a scathing video um, where people were saying, wow, this makes me feel dumb, which seems to be the underto undertone in the marketplace. And, and really that's kind of a, a bashing of Windows. And you know what, I want to give them a shot. I actually like the new layout. It's very mobile-like, it's very edgy, and it's really where the future's going. A couple big news around Microsoft that also that's, that's not really focused on by the big mainstream media is the success of Xbox. And the success of Xbox is really, to me, where Microsoft's key inflection point is going to move. Will Windows be the franchise of the future? Will Xbox be the franchise of the future? We've been clear on SiliconAngle.com and SiliconAngle.tv that we believe that Xbox is the future franchise. And in terms of, uh, in, ter in terms of that, it's no, it's very clear, and we have some videos we can we can show and uh, about this. But Xbox is the franchise. Everyone, the new generation is on Xbox, and we've said tie the phone to Xbox, and you'll be a winner. Um, other great news here is Hadapt is the startup of the showcase uh, winner here at Strata, an emerging startup out of Boston, Massachusetts, and uh, they're doing really really well. Pulling up my uh, little window sheet here from Mark Hopkins, and. Uh, Knocking down the latest news of the day. Let's pull it up. I'm having a hard time getting the internet. Again, we are here at Strata, New York City. This is Silicon Angle's coverage. Uh, we have all kinds of interviews coming up. We had Amr Awadala on. We had Mike Olson um, and uh, a slew of other guests. So we're going to come right back with more news after this short break, and we're going to have more guests. That's a quick update from Strata's floor. This is Silicon Angle's ex exclusive coverage of Str Str Strata plus a dupe world here inside the Cube. We'll be right back. First time on the Cube, baby. Rock and roll. I think it's probably five or six times I've been on the Cube now. Right, and, you know, at first, the guys are just fun to work with. Pat, welcome back. Hey, always a pleasure to be in the Cube. Hey, I'm about to go on the Cube. You never know what's going to happen. I'm uh, a three time veteran of being on the Cube. Uh, I hope many, many more. Chad Sackett, Chad, welcome to the Cube. Dave, John, it's great to be here, man. I keep coming back because uh, great, insightful questions from, uh, from uh, John and from Dave. What face melting action have you seen here at the event? And I know there's a lot of it. It's a great vehicle to uh, to communicate with a broad audience a lot of folks watch. Great to have you back. Good job. All right, Craig Nunez, uh, VP of Marketing at HP Storage. Thanks very much for coming on theCUBE. Yeah. When people mention theCUBE, they, they're like, oh my God, I saw you on theCUBE. And they're all excited about it. It's, it's, a, it's an experience, it's not just information, they experience kind of what's going on there. It's like real time, it's like they were there. That was like My going to the pleasure. gym. Boom, boom. Legendary IBMer, CEO of Symantec, and now CEO of Virtual Instrument. Uh, great to have you on theCUBE. So for CUBE to be here at a conference like this that's got 15, 20,000 people and sharing that live around the world, that's consistent with the way the, the world is evolving. So it's a 
wonderful media, wonderful media. John and Dave are amazing. I don't know how they keep everything in their heads the way they do. Uh, it's a great format, and we're obviously seeing that this notion of real-time coverage and a real conversation is what's driving us as a company. And I, I say it very seriously, when the questions and the comments that we hear from, from them and from all the different guests here directly turn into the products that we build. Yeah, that was my first cube, and uh, I really enjoyed it. There was the rapid fire of questions. It made me think on my feet, but they were very thought-provoking and really got me going on analyzing the, the greatness of Arista and the greatness of the cube as well. John and Dave, the reason their approach works, they're not just guys, you know, reading down the question list, right? Okay, next one, next one. They're, they're, it's a conversation, right? And it's, you know, they're going to challenge you. They're not going to settle for the the marketing hype and the BS and all that stuff that the industry throws around. Come on, you got to hit him up on the HP question. A lot's changed at HP. Some turmoil at the top, obviously, controversy. They're going to hold you down to the, the, the real facts, compare you to the choices our users have, and 